Hello. Welcome. This was something that was on my mind before, and I was thinking about, you know, doing an episode on it, but just in the long run, I kind of just, I just lost interest, or I didn't really want to jinx anything, because I just had such high hopes, and I'm like, yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna happen, everything's gonna be alright, we're gonna be good, but this morning, I was pretty much just upstairs, and brushing my teeth, and shaving, and the question kind of popped in my head randomly, and I just found myself kind of just arguing back and forth with myself in my own head. And if I'm going to be completely honest, and this is just me being completely honest, I have a feeling that EDC 2020 October will not happen. What? I got to be so negative. I know, I know. I'm going to get a lot of hate for this. A lot of, oh my God, you're that's so not a plural attitude to have. Why are you being such a negative Nancy? Don't rain on our parade. And no, quite the contrary. I really do hope it does happen. So I've, I haven't mentioned before, I'm at the stage in my career, in my personal life, where I'm really not going to shows like that anymore as I was a couple of years ago. Especially with me, you know, being a performer myself and putting out music and just getting booked for shows on my own and just juggling a whole bunch of different side projects that I have. It's my time gets like really, really conflicted and strenuous. And on top of that too, I just like to invest more of like my money and income and stuff like that just into, you know, projects like this and my music and other other things that are really important to me. So my festival and show attendance has really declined over the years, which I'm fine with because I'm not I'm the type of person where like if you kinda seen one, you kinda see them all, but you can still, there still is room to get a new and fresh experience out of going to the same festival um, year after year after year. And EDC is no different. Um, the overall groundwork for it is pretty much the same. You know what to expect, but just, you know, with Insomniac and Pasquale and the new artists that are coming in and out every year, the new stages, the new themes, it, 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 it always does take you by surprise. At least it always takes me by surprise. And, he always get keep he has he has his way of keeping people entertained year after year. EDC is pretty much one of those festivals where it's like, all right, maybe I'll go to something smaller, maybe one show, one little smaller festival throughout the year, but that's it. But aside from that, like EDC, I'm definitely going to like no ifs, ands, or buts. That is the one festival I'm going to throughout the whole year, or at least for the year. Trust me, I really, really, really do hope I'm wrong. But just looking at it from my perspective, just looking at the news every day and seeing, you know, new developments and new information being put out on, you know, the, the, the beer bug that shall not be named. <laughs> yeah, it's just, I don't know. It, my, my, my hope is just getting like dimmer and dimmer and dimmer each day. It's crazy. You got no maskers versus pro maskers and you got people trying to get back to work sooner and people trying to stay home and the government's doing this and that and that and, that, and that's it just spiraled into like a whole political thing and i'm just like no no politics no not for me uh, uh some hope some hope is still there for me i from looking at how it is in new york and new jersey things are starting things aren't things are nowhere near like has how they were before the whole thing happened, but I've, I've seen improvement. I see, you know, life still be pretty much contained, but versus over with my friends over in California, what they're going through, because I think their lockdown just like went back in at the time of this recording. So yeah, it's up and up for me. Another reason why I really wanted to put this out there and make this vid was because I wanted to have some like documented proof to look back on and hopefully I can just let, look again hopefully I, I if I'm if I'm wrong about this I will gladly gladly take that L gladly big capital L I will gladly take it and I will be right there along with you looking at you know um, McTwiz from right now present McTwiz or by this time past McTwiz and be like ha 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 you idiot told you it was gonna happen but I don't know we'll see yeah we'll see EDC Las Vegas 2020 October also that'd be really dope too because my birthday is in October so 
that just gives me like more of an excuse to just while out during that whole month it will be funny though if let's just say that it, it does get canceled edc but then a few days later the the cure comes out or the cure and everyone's all ma magically just happy and um better again and not ill and then like <laughs> like a weekend or two after that Pasquale was just like, yeah, so we had to cancel EDC at the last minute, but um, here's Escape. Since Escape happens at around October that time for Halloween, but yeah, that'd be funny. But yes, please, fate or whoever is in charge, prove me wrong, please. <laughs>